In my previous video, you learned about the drama triangle. As you learned in that video, the drama triangle is a powerful model that describes the three roles people often take in toxic relationships. These roles are the persecutor, the victim, or the rescuer roles. The drama triangle is a great model to help you identify patterns of behavior in yourself and others that lead to unhealthy relationships. But what happens if you recognize you are playing one of the roles in the drama triangle? How can you break out of the drama triangle and create calmer, happier, and more loving relationships? The answer is simple. It's time to embrace the winner's triangle. Hello and welcome to the Anger Secrets YouTube channel. I'm Alistair Dews, and over the last 30 years, I've taught over 10,000 men and women how to control their anger, master their emotions, and create calmer, happier, and more loving relationships. On this channel, I'll share the proven tools and techniques I've used to help my clients control their anger and transform their lives. For free support on your anger management journey, including free training and the opportunity to book a free 20-minute anger assessment call with me, visit my website, angersecrets.com. I look forward to talking with you. Okay, let's jump into transforming relationships, embracing the winner's triangle. So what is the winner's triangle? The winner's triangle is a model developed by psychologist A.C. Choi as a healthy alternative to the drama triangle. It provides a simple framework for creating positive relationship communication and is an antidote to the drama triangle. Just like the drama triangle, the winner's triangle consists of three roles. These roles are the assertive, vulnerable, and caring roles. Let's look at each role in detail, starting with the assertive role. People who take up the assertive role express their needs, feelings, and desires clearly and directly. Set boundaries and maintain them. Take responsibility for their actions. Respect others' rights and feelings and seek solutions rather than blaming or criticizing others. The assertive role is the opposite of the persecutor role in the drama triangle. By expressing yourself assertively, you can replace the persecutor's aggressive behavior with respectful and direct communication. Now, let's look at the vulnerable role. People who take up the vulnerable role share their feelings, fears, and insecurities openly take responsibility for their emotions and experiences, seek support and understanding rather than playing the victim, are open to feedback and growth, and recognize their power to make changes and change. The vulnerable role is the opposite of the victim role in the drama triangle. By taking up a vulnerable position instead of playing the victim, you replace the victim's need for approval by expressing your true feelings, needs, and worries. Finally, let's look at the caring role. People who take up the caring role offer support and encouragement, listen actively and empathetically, respect others' autonomy and choices, are available without being overbearing or controlling, and empathize with others without taking the situation over. The caring role is the opposite of the rescuer role in the drama triangle. By taking up the caring role instead of rescuing, you replace the rescuer's need to control and manipulate with a genuine desire to understand and help. This respects other people's autonomy while still offering them emotional support. How can you apply the winner's triangle in your relationship? To apply the winner's triangle in your relationship, you must first recognize when you are slipping into the drama triangle roles. Once you've identified this, consciously shift into the corresponding role in the winner's triangle. For example, if you notice yourself taking up the persecutor role by blaming or criticizing your partner, switch to the assertive role and express your feelings and needs directly. You can do this by clearly expressing your needs, feelings, and desires while respecting your partner's rights and feelings and not putting your partner down in any way. Similarly, if you find yourself in the victim role, remind yourself to be vulnerable and take responsibility for your emotions. Share your feelings, fears, and insecurities openly with your partner, but don't rely on them 
to solve your problems. Finally, if you notice yourself taking up the rescuer role, switch to the caring role and offer emotional support to your partner without being overbearing or controlling. Listen actively, empathize with their experience and respect their autonomy and choices. Let's look at a simple example of using the winner's triangle to break free from toxic relationships. Let's say that you've come home after a long day at work. Your partner has forgotten to do the grocery shopping, leaving you with no dinner options. In the drama triangle, you may enter the persecutor role and blame your partner for not getting the groceries. For example, you may say something like, I can't believe you forgot to go grocery shopping. You're so irresponsible. What am I supposed to do for dinner? This statement could easily lead to conflict or drama. For example, your partner may take up a victim or rescuer role and an argument could quickly ensue. Instead of this dynamic, however, you can transform your relationship and break the cycle of toxic behavior by using the winner's triangle. In this situation, instead of entering the persecutor role, you could take up an assertive role and express your feelings respectfully. For example, instead of saying, I can't believe you forgot to go grocery shopping. You're so irresponsible. What am I supposed to do for dinner? You could say, I feel frustrated that there's no food in the house because the grocery shopping wasn't done. Can we discuss how to avoid this situation in the future? Being assertive instead of taking up the persecutor role makes you far more likely to create a constructive dialogue with your partner. This will help you break free from toxic behavior and create a more respectful and healthy relationship. Using the winner's triangle in your daily interactions will transform your relationship and create calmer, happier, and more respectful interactions with everyone around you. Remember, it takes practice and self-awareness to shift from the drama triangle to the winner's triangle. So be patient with yourself as you adopt these healthier roles. Thanks for watching today's video. If you found it helpful, please like this show and click the subscribe button below. This will help other people struggling with anger find and benefit from this show. Remember, for free support on your anger management journey, including free training and the opportunity to book a free 20-minute anger assessment call with me, visit my website, angersecrets.com. I look forward to talking with you. And finally, remember, you can't control other people but you can control yourself. I'll see you in the next video. Take care. The Anger Secrets YouTube channel is intended for information and educational purposes only. It is not a substitute for professional medical advice, diagnosis, or treatment. No medical or therapeutic relationship is implied or created by this video. If you have mental health concerns of any type, please seek out the help of a local mental health professional.